All right. Well, the right lighting can really change the mood of any space. And when you're building a custom home, you should plan for how your lighting will look throughout the entire house. In this week's Home Builder Spotlight, Paul Schumacher from Schumacher Homes shows us some of the most popular lighting trends and how you can make lighting the showpiece of any room. Hi, I'm Paul Schumacher with Schumacher Homes and welcome to the Home Builder Spotlight. When planning for lighting in your custom home, it's a good idea to start with a plan that incorporates three different types of light, ambient, accent, and task. Today I'm gonna to cover these types and provide some tips on how to incorporate lighting into your new custom home. Ambient lighting is the general light that comes from an overhead fixture such as recessed lighting. Other examples of ambient lighting consist of track, cove, and soffit, overhead chandeliers, and flush mounts. Natural daylight is a good source of ambient lighting and should be considered when designing a space in your home. Accent lighting helps create visual interest and adds drama to a room. It is used to draw the eye to key features such as paintings, sculptures, and other focal points. Whether reading, cooking, or playing games, task lighting helps perform a specific task in a space. The majority of the time it is incorporated in the bath and kitchen areas. Under cabinet lighting and pendants are both excellent sources for task lighting. A popular trend right now is the use of geometric shapes for pendants as they provide an airy, casual appeal, making them perfect for just about anywhere in the house where task lighting is needed. When designing a dining room or working with a space over a table, the light fixture is typically the showpiece of the room. Not only is it the focal point, but it also provides even light distribution and direct light for diners. In the bath area, the vanity, the freestanding tub, and shower all require different lighting choices, but the critical thing to remember is that the result should be cohesive. Start by selecting a combination of ambient lights such as chandeliers, pendants, or flush mounts. Then incorporate a second layer of task lighting for daily grooming activities like shaving. Lastly, include accent lighting to highlight the decorative and architectural features of the space. When choosing the lighting for your home, it's important to go to a design studio that has a lot of variety of lighting like we have here. I'm Paul Schumacher with Schumacher Home. And for more information about today's segment, go to fox8.com, click on Scene on TV.